I don't know if I'm going to say kids that we talk about, about um, a lot of lights and um, actually about how um, Ian was talking about his uh, trainee wish um, just got me thinking um, where ever since I was um, a trainee uh, it's been a while isn't it man? <laughs> <laughs> yeah the first time I came was 2011 Yeah, it's been a really big journey, and um, there have been quite a lot of times when oh I've been, you know, I, I, I submerged myself in darkness. Um, and, 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 I was always just, always wondering just, just who I am, um, uh, who I need to rely on if my dream is, you know, if it's actually my dream. And, um, you know, during those training times, um, I'd have people that I could really rely on, but then they would, you know, go and then new, new people would come and then they would go. But, um, you know, I'm just really glad that, you know, right now I could have my boys with me here today. Just talking about lights, um, you know, even in that darkness, um, and even physically, um, I would train in darkness as well. Because I know I, I like dark stuff. In the pants, I would have black clothes. But um, you know, I just want to say that even if back then I did see lights, um, I saw in fact eight lights. Um, you got the number count right this time. Today I feel like as long as I'm with say, um, can we can we can we have the lights off, please? And can we see our stays? Today is our brightest light that would guide us to where we want to go. You know, just even on stage when we're supposed to be all lights are off and we're supposed to be, you know, just creeping in. But because of all your lights, you can see everything. And um, I just want to say that. Darkness as well, just I hope that you guys can find us and find light through us as well. Okay? 